It's an exciting new technology. It only began one year ago in the United States. However, it started in Japan 17 years ago. Well, this week I'm going to give you 25 different ways that you can start using this technology in your dealership. Hi, I'm Paul Potratz and welcome to this week's Think Tank Tuesday. Well, this week we're going to talk a little more about QR codes because it's a fascinating technology. The year was 1994 that Toyota created the QR code for parts that were coming down the conveyor belts. It stands for Quick Reader. But in Japan, how they actually use the QR code is far-reaching. They use it where it's actually on the buildings. You can scan a QR code and get the directions in different languages. It's also on street signs. And get this, it's even on the tombstones. So it's not a fad. This is a technology that will continue to grow, even though it started only a year ago in the United States. Consider there's 70 million smartphones in the United States, and that number is only going to grow. In fact, by 2013, smartphones like the iPhone and the Droid are supposed to outnumber a laptop and a desktop computer. So the possibilities are going to be endless. So let's go through 25 different ways that you can start using QR codes in your dealership. First one, billboards. Put a billboard and someone can scan it from a distance. In fact, you can even put it by a competitor's dealership. Next option is get a 10 by 10 vinyl banner created and hang it from the front of your showroom. Hang it out in front of your dealership. Just imagine the conversation it's going to create and you'll be able to drive people to whatever website you want to drive and serve them the remarketing code. Surely you have a remarketing code. Another element as far as table tents. You can create a table tent that has all your brands on it so a consumer can scan about each individual model. Another one, surveys. You want to increase the reviews for your dealership? Create the QR code, direct somebody to the review site, and let them do the review on their smartphone for your dealership. Another use, business cards. Put a QR code on your salespeople's business cards. The one can be the contact information for the salesperson, another QR code could be for the service department, and then the final QR code could be for the dealership. Also create stickers that will go on the sun visors, for example, or go into the glove box. This will allow you to build your service or your towing collision business, plus your parts and sales. Email signature, QR code. TV commercials, QR code. Newspaper ad, QR code. Direct mail, the list goes on. Your online videos, so you can use QR codes on basically everything. So check out the list and see all the uses of the QR codes. And keep in mind, the possibilities are endless with 70 million smartphones in the market. And that number is only growing. Come up with your mobile strategy for your dealership and double those leads in no time. That's this week's tip. Be sure and tune in next week. Thanks for watching Think Tank Tuesday. Tune in next week for more tips in the world of automotive digital marketing from Potratz. To download this podcast or watch previous episodes, search for us on iTunes. To learn more, visit us at ppadv.com.